Okay, Robert. Um, as I discussed earlier on uh, at the beginning of the DVD series, the most important thing is the proper use of the hands. And I see you getting around the ball and rolling over a little too soon. So I'm gonna teach you a drill and teach you guys a drill as well. Let me see the bat. This drill is called no feet, no shoulders. And the reason we call it that is because we're not gonna use our feet or our shoulders. So I wanna show everybody the audience. This is the way it should look. I'm gonna grip the bat with my top hand slightly cupped. And a lot of hitters, like I said earlier, will pull with their hands and their shoulders at the same time. So we wanna keep that from happening because we want the, the barrel of the bat to stay in this hitting area as long as possible. I'll go ahead and show you another view. But we want the barrel of the bat to stay in this hitting area as long as possible. And that allows me to get fooled a little bit, which happens quite often. But it also allows me to make hard contact if I do get fooled. And if I do have the correct bat, uh, bat angle, then obviously I can hit the ball even harder. But this is the way it's gonna look, Robert. You're gonna, I'll go ahead and show the, the audience too, but the feet are gonna stay flat on the ground. I'm gonna start where you start. Go ahead and start there. And you're gonna swing by pulling the knob. And as you, as you release the bat to the ball, as you release the bat to the ball, you're gonna let your top hand stay here and continue to let your bottom hand accelerate through the ball with your shoulder staying square. So again, if you wanna look at it from this angle, I wanna go ahead, start here, pull the knob, let my top hand slide off and notice how my shoulders didn't rotate in the swing. So let's see if you can get that going. Perfect. That's very nice. A little sooner with the top hand. Okay, that's pretty good. The one thing I would alter a little bit is I would have you, you go from here and then you get here. Now this back elbow has to come back down before I hit. So why don't we start closer and think of going from point A to point B. Okay, instead of here, and if I'm here, then I gotta get back to here before I can go and use my hands and get to the ball. So let's just start here and go from here to the ball. But overall, it's a lot more bat speed that I see. Okay, drop that back elbow a little more. Back elbow, there, good. That's, that's what I'm looking for right there. 